Hey guys, Keith of Alaskan Motorhome here, and uh, it is Wednesday, May 26th, I believe. And uh, I am on my way to go meet a guy to buy a trailer hitch motorcycle carrier. Uh, I can order one. I was going to order a brand new one that had a, a double where you could put two dirt bikes on the back. But uh, I wanted one for this weekend and it won't be here. So another guy's got one he's selling on Craigslist. So I'm going to go check it out and buy it. And I could always have a spare if a friend needs it. So I'm going to go check that out. So let's go see how good it looks. Just passing the Fairbanks Airport. Okay guys, so I went ahead and I bought the uh, used uh, trailer hitch motorcycle carrier and now I'm on my way home. Kind of didn't even think about how to haul it because I drove my car and uh, so now I've got it in the trunk kind of strapped down with some kayak straps and then holding the so I'm trying to drive home real easy so it doesn't fall out. It's been raining here in Fairbanks all week. So I just been working in the house, finishing up the uh, hardwood floor project. So that's how I had to load it and bring it home. Well, so here is my used uh, trailer hitch motorcycle carrier that I just bought. It has a ramp to help load. And uh, the guy put on an extra brace because he said it wobbled a little bit on him. And I expected that. But uh, it looks like a pretty solid construction. All steel and then the ramp is aluminum, so... I'm going to put it on the back of the RV and we'll see how it fits. Now, so here's my uh, trailer hitch motorcycle carrier. I washed it up. It doesn't look too bad now. Has an aluminum ramp, and then I guess the rest is all steel. So, my only problem with it is it's got that wobble. So, I'm going to work on trying to get that out somehow, strengthen it, and then I'm going to try to load the bike here in just a few. So.